guys, it's Ali. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am reviewing, applying, swatching the brand new Cheeky Vegan Blushes by Glowish, which is a brand by Huda Beauty, if you aren't aware. So if you guys want to see the shades that I picked up, how the products were, and all of the fun stuff, then go ahead and keep on watching. Before we get into the blushes, if you are wondering about the little eye look that I have got today, I did film it. The video will be linked in the description box down below once I have it finished editing and doing all of that fun stuff. So it won't be up immediately, I'm not gonna lie, because I have a lot of things to do. But, guys, I love this look and I'm really, really excited to get this video out for you all to watch. But today we are focusing on the Huda Beauty blushes, which I have right here. So these are 18 pounds each here in the UK. They did launch a couple of days ago with some powder foundations. I contemplated getting the powder foundations, but I feel like the more I watched the promotional videos and the application and stuff like that, it just looked like a product that I was not going to like. If you have seen my video on this product, which is the Glowish Multi Dew Skin Tint, then you know I wasn't a huge fan of this either. I'm not sure how I feel about Glowish complexion products, but I did really, really, really love the bronzer that was launched with the skin tint. So when I saw the blushes come out, I thought to myself, if the formula is going to be anything like the bronzer, I'm going to love it. So let's go ahead and take a look at these blushes. There were four different shades launched. I went ahead and picked up the two deepest shades, which are number three and number four, and they are called Very Juicy and Charming Cherry. The other two just looked like they were gonna to be too light for me, so I didn't pick those up, but this is what the box looks like. I feel like I'm talking a mile a minute, so let me just calm myself down, and let's have a look. So they are quite small, but at this point I can't knock a brand for having small blushes when I rave about the Fenty Beauty blush, which is tiny. So it does have 2.5 grams or 0.08 ounces of product in here. And this is what the packaging looks like. Pretty much the same as a lot of the other glowish stuff. And I'm gonna try to open it. So when you open it, this is what it looks like. And it does have a small mirror in there. Mine is just covered by a frosted sticker. But this is the shade Very Juicy. And this is a Charming Cherry. I don't know why, but I thought the packages would match the color of the product, but it's all uniform. They are the exact same color. And these are the two shades side by side. Very Juicy, Charming Cherry. So this is Very Juicy. And then just underneath, I'm gonna go ahead and swatch Charming Cherry. So this is what the two shades look like on my skin. I think just from looking, Very Juicy might be the shade that I lean towards, but also Charming Cherry put on very subtly, I think is also going to look very nice. I'm gonna apply the product on each cheek just so we can see the color differences and how they look. So I think I'll start with number three, which is our Very Juicy. And I'm gonna use a brush to apply it. So I'm just taking a small amount of the product. Hello. Okay. And I'm just gonna smile, start at the apple. Yeah, I knew I was gonna love the formula because do you see? It's a very, very flawless. I love that. I think that's super, super pretty. Yeah, this product is definitely everything that I expected it to be. And it is up there now with one of my favorite blushes. Oh, stop. I think that is super flattering. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take 
Charming Cherry on the other cheek. Okay, so yeah, this is... I just love the application of these blushes. That is absolutely stunning, you guys. Yes, I feel like Glowish is my brand for blushes and bronzes and it'd be really nice to see a highlighter as well in this exact same formula because it is absolutely to die for. It's one of the easiest, easiest formulas to work with. So once again, this is a very juicy Charming Cherry. Very juicy. Charming Cherry. There's not much else I can say about this blush. I do really, really love the formula and the colour payoff I think is amazing. It is one of those products that I feel is buildable because I haven't put a lot on. I just wanted a flush of colour. So on this side, it, it was pretty much just a single application. I did build up a bit more on the Charming Cherry side. So you can see that the colour is a little bit more intense on this side, but... I really, really like these blushes. I can't really complain too much about the price because it is sort of matched up with its competitors. And in terms of formula and delivery, this is definitely one of those products that I feel like is up there. I would love to see an extended shade range just so there's a little bit more to play with. But so far, I'm here for it. I think I might actually like these blushes a little bit more than I like my Pat McGrath blushes. <sighs> yeah. I just think it's an all round good product and I'm here for it. Everything will be linked in the description box down below. If of course I have missed out any questions or anything that you feel like should have been covered in this video then of course go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section and I will address it if I can if I don't know the answer I will try and find it but thank you guys so so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next video which is probably going to be this look at me <laughs> it's probably going to be the video that I filmed this look for so I'll see you guys there